What's up guys, this is TBZ. Here with Crispy. And we're doing an unboxing of the Ultimate Astro A50 headset, plus a mix amp. And I've been, uh, these, are, these are mine, these are TBZs. Uh, I picked them up um, just today, finally got them in store, and I've been waiting so long for these. Yeah. Finally got them, I'm in Australia, as you most of you should know already, but oh man, this is awesome. So I'm going to do an unboxing for you guys. So um, first, this is the packaging, straight up. Um, you got your Astros at A uh, A50s on the front. You just got a, uh, I guess that's just, uh, it's like their design and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Design. <laughs> then a bit of the specs on the back. So obviously these are the A50s. They are the wireless version of the A40s, effectively. Um, uh, and it's got the built-in mix amp as well. Um, and uh, I guess we can just uh, jump in and unbox yeah. this one. So uh, that, the best part, peeling off that plastic. Oh my god, it's like my dream. And I got my trusty little knife. Yeah. <laughs> it just, oh, it's so good. Okay, cut that out of the way. Alright, so here it is, and oh, it slides nice. right out like that. Oh, good design. Yeah, I know, I just, I just love good packaging. Reminds me of Ray's of it. Cool, so that's the little outside bit. Put that over there. Yeah. And now, what I have to do, if you just want to come up a little bit, is um, flip it over. If I sound a bit retarded, by the way, that's because I am slightly unwell today, but that's fine. And now we have the inside, and that is these are the Astros. So we got the actual headset, we got the mix amp with uh, all the ports and stuff, and underneath will be all the cables. So let's do that. So here is oh. the actual headset itself. Smelling good. <laughs> smelling new, smelling good. We got the right and left ears and the microphone, um, which is actually really cool. Uh, just like my previous headset, the G35s, it has the mute mechanism where it has a little bit of a click when you move it across there, a little bit of a button, and when it goes past that little point, it mutes the microphone, so it's train. a lot easier to, um, yeah. I don't know, just mute yourself. rather than going for a switch and stuff. On the side here, we have the volume and stuff for voice and game. So essentially what that means is you can go over here, tap it over here, and that increases the voice and lowers the game sound, or you can tap on the game sound, increase the game sound, lower the voice. No way, stuff. that's yeah, awesome. Yeah, doing some uh, serious uh, sound whoring on Call of Duty or Battlefield or whatever you play. That's so annoying sometimes when I'm like, Skype is so much louder than the game. Yeah, yeah. I know, right? It's yeah. so annoying. But uh, anyway, these are the headsets. Awesome, and we'll get back into that soon. Oh, actually, I'll just jump into the, some of the ports and stuff. So you've got the mini USB to mini USB for the charging, because they are wireless. Uh, and this here is for the 360. Unfortunately, because um, there's only one headset that's going to be made for wild, actual wireless for 360, um, which will be a Trident headset, but these are the A50. So obviously you have to plug, it is sort of wireless, you have to plug the little cable that you get in the box into the 360 controller. Um, if you want to go, that's as wireless as, as it gets for the 360. But with the PS3, that doesn't, that's irrelevant. Um, then over here you have your three... Um, level, oh, it's like uh, different types of sound, it's very, um, I'll jump into that a bit more depth later. Like AQ? Um, yeah, it's got like balanced, um, like bass. Like multiplayer, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's very, but like very popular. For games, yeah, and then, standard volume thing, and then the power thing there. So, um, cool, that's the actual headset, you got the Astro headband, freaking cool, just the yeah. Astro on there, and um, oh, I can't wait to put them on for the first time, but just going to pop them aside. Next, we have the mix amp, which is very nice. I love taking these off as well. Oh, <laughs> so good. Very good. All right, and then we got the power button and Dolby Digital surround sound. Uh, and then on the back, we have the port, so we have the auxiliary in, the power, um, and then optical in, optical out, and USB port as well. So yeah. that's essentially the mix amp, um, and we'll just put that aside. Yeah. All right, now let's see how much further in we can get to this. It's got like a tab that you can oh, Yes, tabs. Making. Yeah, Alright, so next we have a little quick start guide with a bunch of stuff with a stand. It shows yeah. you everything, how everything works, blah, blah, blah. And a little bit of an Astro. <laughs> Excuse me. Wow. Like I said, I wasn't feeling that great, but that's fine. Uh, cool, so that just shows you, like I was saying, with the 360 control, it plugs into the headset. All the PS3, how to set it up, basically. Cool, useful stuff. And next we have the stand. Awesome. Yeah, that's a good part. Out comes that well basically just parts of the stand. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's get whatever we have. Um we have the USB. Uh it's me USB. Bottom of the stand. Awesome. I'm just gonna pop that over here. And then optical cables and just all the cables basically. Sweet, so that's, well, I guess that's pretty much everything. 
what I'm going to do is quickly jump um, onto putting the stand together, pop the headset on there, set it up, get into all the specs and tell you about it quickly before we finish up. So be back in a sec, guys. Guys, we are back and we've set everything up, kind of. Um, I've just kind of decided to leave these cables laying out here because I can just talk you through what they do and stuff. Um, so this is the stand all set up with the headset on top. Um, simply just hangs like that, nice and easy. It's a lot better and useful to have a stand because, you know, uh, like, uh, as you can see on my G35s, I kind of just like hung them there and it was a bit stupid when they fell off and they can break and stuff happens. So really cool idea to chuck a stand in there by Astro. Love it. Um, so you have the mix amp, um, I've got a little power cable in the back and that just plugs into your console or whatever to give that power. Um, and then this is the other USB, so mini USB into the headset and then you can charge it by plugging into anything that gives USB power or whatever. Um, that here, that, like I said, it's just a 360 cable to plug that into the controller, so it goes into the headset and then into the controller. And that's how wireless works for 360. And finally the optical cable, and this is how you get your sound from the actual console to go into the headset. Um, and that just goes into the back of here in the optical, one of the optical ports and then you chuck it into the back of the optical port in your 360 or PS3 or PC or whatever you're using um, the headset for but that is pretty much it guys it was just a simple unboxing and this is just one of the best headsets I've ever had and ever will have I believe um, and I'm so far I'm just loving it I haven't even freaking used them yet so okay. um, just really good to share that with you guys, and um, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, please like uh, and comment below. If you have any questions, that'd be awesome. We would love to answer you guys. Um, otherwise, enjoy the rest of your day. This is TBZ. Here with Crispy. And they are from ETR Gamer, and enjoy the rest of the day, guys. See ya. See ya.